What is going on everyone, it's your boy Kieran the Barber. Today's video is all about inspiration and people who inspire us. So I've got my top five barbers that inspire me personally. I hope you enjoy my video. If you do, you know where that subscribe button is. It's right about here. Get on that subscribe button, get on that like button, comment, tell me who inspires you. Um, it doesn't have to be me, it might be me. You know, I'm here still, but you know, you can pick other barbers if you really want. So get in that comment section, tell me who, you, who inspires you, and don't forget that subscribe button. All right, it's still there. So in at number five, um, I've got two barbers. They work at um, one shop. Um, they're from Northern Ireland. Absolutely the sickest barbers you'll ever meet. They blow the system when I say they blow the system. Now, they are um, both young barbers, but male barbers. They work at Ryan Cullen Hair, I believe. The barbers I'm talking about, so for my, for my number five, I'm going to have two barbers. You'll, oh, you'll see that through this, it's more the shops that inspire me and, and the barbers as such. So I've got Ryan Cullen and Connor Taff. Both of them are outstanding barbers. Oh, they're on another level of barbering. Definitely go check out both their Instagrams. Instagram is Ryan Cullen, which is Ryan Cullen Hair. Should be about here, I don't know, it might be a bit longer. Um, and then the second one is Connor Taff Hair. Now, Connor and Ryan both not only can cut hair, fantastic, but cutting hair is only half the battle. Their styling is on another level of styling. Their haircut is in most barbershops. Um, it is on. It is in the top ten of, of most barber pages or haircutting pages. When you search up men's hairstyle on Google, both of their haircuts are in the top 10 haircuts. Try it, if you don't believe me. They're absolutely outstanding. Um, they come up with the surgical part. They come up with the more texturized, separated top. They're creative, they're innovative. They're, and beyond all, I call them my friends. They're both absolutely lovely guys as well. They're good to speak to. I got to have a real, real catch up, even like a good couple of hours with Ryan. Um, earlier this year and not only did he have time for me um, he was talking about my work I was talking about his work and, and we, we whacked our heads together we come up with some stuff I'll hopefully be doing some collabs with Ryan and Connor soon on this channel so keep it keep it posted so yeah that's my number five for them two absolutely outstanding barbers yeah. Okay, so for my number four, um, I'm gonna pick this guy on the basis of not only can he cut hair, he can cut any type of hair. He tells me, he tells everyone that hair is just a fabric um, and it's the way of life. He honestly cuts hair so good. He, he, he texturizes, he thins, he chips, he, he makes sharp edges, he breaks the rules. Um, he cuts men's and women's hair. He, he just goes beyond on what other barbers do. There's a wall and he smashed it down. He's an arrogant sod, don't get me wrong, and he loves himself because he's a good looking bugger. Um, his name is Darren Jones. Some people know him as Darren Andis Jones because he is also an international educator for Andis. Now, he is from Birmingham in the UK. He specializes in more Afro hair. He does Afro classes. He does seminars all around the world. Um, he was recently in Florida, um, he travels to Ireland and Scotland quite a bit um, and he, every weekend he's fully booked. I think he said he was fully booked till next August or September so if you're, if you're in the UK and you're ever looking for some more, um, more education I'd definitely say speak to Darren Jones, he is, he is one for education. The, the thing with Darren Jones is, um, and this is where me and Darren Jones are very different and this is what I, I quite like about Darren Jones, when I do my YouTube videos I try and keep it as simple as I can because of a wide range of audience that I have. I have um, beginners to intermediates to people who are 
been cutting hair for 34 years. Um, so I try and keep it as simple as I can. Just I go through the motions and, and I try to explain. Darren Jones goes to another level. He can tell you how many screws are in a clipper, for example. He's just got pure knowledge of his work and his craft. Um, he knows what he's cutting, how he's cutting it. He's just got such visual artist direction to what he's doing. Um, and again, it, if you take out that he's arrogant, because he is, <laughs> um, I'll tell you why he's arrogant, because he used to call himself the UK's number one barber on um, Instagram. She changed that, though, didn't he? When he met me. <laughs> um, he's, he's a lovely guy, and he's got a really, really good sense of humour. Hence why, when I talk about him, I like to laugh and I like to banter with him, because he is actually a proper lovely guy. He's got a lot of time for education. Education is key um, with, with Darren Jones. So yeah, his Instagram is Darren underscore Andis underscore Jones. Um, but yeah, these Instagrams are long, aren't they? So yeah, I'm going to try and fit that on one page. Give him a follow. Um, and yeah, if you're, if you're ever in the UK and you need some education, he's one of the people to go to. Yeah. So my number two on the list. Um, is real simple. These guys I followed for a long, long time. I need a drink. Free. Now he's a favourite of mine, personal favourite, a massive, massive inspiration of mine. Um, and the funny thing is, not a lot of people know him. And I, and everyone will agree with me in this. Everybody at some point hits a wall where. They feel like they can't get no further. I hit it in the shop um, a, a lot where I'm doing a haircut and I'm like, there's so much better barbers out there than me. Um, I, I get myself down about it. Um, and, and then I have to go look for inspiration. And all these guys who I'm, I'm gonna talk about today, they're on my top Instagram. When you, when you press my search on my Instagram, all these guys float up. But the main one for me personally, especially when I go to Instagram, um, is a guy called I Am Chieto. Um, I think that's how you say it. It'll probably kill me if it don't. Um, but I'm gonna put it in here. So it's, his Instagram is at I Am Chieto. His name is Jose Barreto. Jose Barreto. I'm gonna say it like that. See, I got it. Um, man, that, that guy can cut hair. I've been following him for about three years now, and we, we talk quite a lot. Um, he's one of the nicest guys um, and may God bless that guy because he is so nice and he's got all the time in the world for me. When I'm having a bad time, I always message him and go, man, I've, I've hit a wall. Send me some images, come on, man. And he, he, send me, he sends me his work and I'm like, how do you do it? And he goes, I do this and this and this. And he's an absolute lovely guy. Definitely, definitely give him a follow. Not only is he amazing, it is his craft, but he's also a really lovely guy. Um, and he definitely deserves a follow from, from all of you guys. I know all of you are watching. I know all of you are going to go on Instagram while you're on your phone. You know, if you're watching this on a laptop, you can go on your phone, just you know, scroll through all these people that I'm saying, do, 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 follow, follow, follow. You got this. So again, his name is I Am Chieto. Um, definitely give him a follow. Awesome guy. So, on to my number two. Now, it's my number two because there's two of them again. Um, I just want to say, first of all, that they are amazing barbers. I've been following um, them both probably since day one on Instagram. They were two of the first barbers that I actually followed. Um, and yeah, no, they are, they are outstanding in their styling. They're outstanding in their cuts. They work on such a system for both of them that they bring a hairdressery background and their styling background to the barbering world. So not only can they cut hair and, and barber, but they can also style really well. Um, they do shows with the Barber Bash. They do seminars with the Barber Bash. They're all over the Barber Bash. Um, so if you're ever at a Great British Barber Bash, you'll probably know already who I'm talking about. Um, um, they're brothers, which is cool. Um, and they are Alan Beak and Reese Beak, um, good friends of mine. So if you ever get to follow Alan. So Alan underscore Beak 
is Alan's Instagram name. I'm going to put it about here. I, if you follow me, I presume 90% of you on here already follow Alan. Um, then there's no two ways about it. He is. <laughs> I'm here and Alan's way up here, like he is the superstar of barbering. He is someone who I massively look up to. Um, his work is perfection. You, you can't ever, ever deny his work. Um, and his brother, Reespeak, is on Instagram as Mozambique. It's gonna be about here. So give Reese a follow as well. Um, Reese is more quieter, he likes to get on with his work. Um, such a cool guy. When you when you get to have a one-on-one -on -one with him, he's got so many stories, so many cool stuff about him. Um, and he, by far, is one of the best barbers I've ever seen in my life. Um, he's such a cool guy. Respeak um, has perfected the skin fade pump. Um, the skin fade slick back, the skin fade side part. I don't think there is anyone in this industry that actually does it better than him. Um, and I'm I'm not gonna lie. If you check out his work, Mozambique, um, I you can you can see for yourself. I, I genuinely don't think there's anyone in the industry that does better than him. He is the master of the skin fade, especially the low skin fades and the tapes. I always look at his work for inspiration. Um, I always get confused because I look at it and I'm like, how did he do that? I haven't got a clue how he does that. Um, I would love to genuinely, I'm going to have to go to um, Ruger Barbers, their shop, and I'm going to have to sit there and watch him um, cut soon. I've got to go down there because, again, all these people who inspire me, I, I talk to quite a bit. Um, and both of them, Alan and Reese, are really, really lovely guys. Um, and they're always very forward. If you ever need to talk to them, um, they will always message you back. They will always try and help you out because they love the industry. And if you're in the industry and you want help and you're nice about it, I'm sure they're going to be absolutely nice back to you and they're, they're going to try and point you in the right direction to help you as much as they can. If you ever go um, to um, Gary Spencer, love, lovely guy as well, holds the Great British Barber Bash. Um, and Alan and Reese are always there. Uh, along, alongside, sometimes I Ryan, Cullen, Connor, um, and all these other guys. Um, Darren Jones does also seminars with the Great British Barber Bash. So yeah, I would definitely say if you if you look up Great British Barber Bash, you can see all the people that are on there, um, and you can see what what shows they do. But if you ever get to go to an Alan and Reese seminar, definitely take it up. I definitely need to at some point. I need to go there and see them because their work is flawless. Yeah. So now on to my number one, um, barbers that inspire me. Now it's this two of them. Um, they have a shop in Northern Ireland again. Um, I don't know what's going on, there's something in the Irish water obviously, what's bringing out all this absolutely amazing talent. Um, if I sat here and I'm gonna do some honorable mentions afterwards, but if, if I sat here and genuinely, honestly, from the bottom of my heart, did honorable mentions, um, and mentioned everyone I'd be here if this video would be two hours long and 50% of it would be the Irish lads all of them are outstanding um, so yeah these these two Irish lads fantastic awesome um, they they cut famous people they, they they just break these boundaries and not only that they they can they cut differently they create they set styles they they set trends like um, I'm going to tell you who they are, it's, it's, one is Neil Toner, um, Neil is an awesome guy, not only is Neil awesome but he loves, he loves MMA, he loves UFC and stuff like that and I get to talk to him about it which is cool, um, and the other is Mickey Graham, so, so first of all you want to be following Neil, which is Jeff H underscore social, um, that's the name of his shop, where he has a, I believe he has a clothes shop in there, and it's a barbershop, it is the coolest atmosphere ever. Um, and then you've got Mickey Graham, um, personal favourite of mine, he wins that award. Uh, <laughs> he, he wins the award for being my favourite because I'll tell you a story why. Um, Mickey does the coolest haircuts ever. Um, he does them where he, he uses hair powders, so he does skin fades quite low, keeps the edges around here, you must have seen them. 
and then what he does is he will flow through the hair with powder and um, hairspray and I once messaged Mickey Graham um, when, when I got to know him a bit and I said Mickey please can you do me a video and show me how you style I am absolutely clueless and I would love to learn he recorded a 20 minute video just for me um, and sent me it via, via WhatsApp um, and it was a video of him going through his technique, how he styles it, going through everything. Didn't need to do that. Who needs to do that? Um, no one needs to do that. He could have gone do one. Like that's my stuff. That's my technique. The guy had the patience and the time to go through everything with me, um, and that does not go away. I really, really appreciated that. Um, they're lovely guys, and they are by far superior in this industry. I believe they do the barber bash as well. So all of these guys' Instagrams, I'm going to be putting in a list below in the description so you can literally copy, hold it, copy, paste, get them on there. If you don't follow them already, I presume you already do because if you follow me, you must follow all them guys. They are much better than me. And that's not me, be it, that's me being honest, that's me being real. I idolise them because that's the standard of um, level that I would like to hit one day. Um, and I look up to them in a massive way. And the fact that they actually give me feedback so quickly, just some honourable mentions, um, because you obviously you can never fit anyone in a top five. And everyone who actually inspires you, there's not just five people, especially for me, I like to look at everyone. Um, uh, my first my first one is Baldy, the guys at Hard Grind, one like that, Tom, Tommy Poppet, um, Jim, John Bourne, 360 Yeezy, Champs, I forgot Champs, Tom Trapp, Toast Styles, Men Spire, Josh Lamonica, Danny, oh my god, Danny Robinson, like, see, and I'm thinking, I'm like, oh, why, why would I not include these? Danny Robinson had, like, this, this photo walk just went fucking ape shit. It went viral. It was, like, the best pompadour I'd ever seen in my whole life. Um, and he's a funny guy as well. <laughs> like, I love Danny. Adam Salone, Joe Salone. Joe is the only guy I know from rock a velour tracksuit to a barber show and get away with it like the guy fucking rigs cornets Ken Forley so that's that's my honourable mentions I'm really sorry if I left any of you out it is currently here it is Monday morning I might get this on a different day it is Monday morning and I'm slightly a bit I need a couple of coffees but honourable mentions honestly go check all these guys out and then from there go suggested follow and you'll find all these other amazing barbers so all of these guys' Instagrams, I'm going to be putting in a list below in the description so you can literally copy, hold it, copy, paste, get them on there. If you don't follow them already, I presume you already do because if you follow me, you must follow all them guys. They are much better than me. And that's not me, be it, that's me being honest, that's me being real. I idolise them because that's the standard of um, level that I would like to hit one day. Um, and I look up to them in a massive way. And the fact that they actually give me feedback, um, take time out to, to message me and to even send me videos uh, is, is goes beyond belief of whatever I could ask for. So these, these are my top five guys who inspire me um, on Instagram. Definitely give them all a follow. Um, and while you're here, you might as well, I'm just, you know, subscribe button's just there. You know, get that clip, come on. What's, what's the worst that could happen? You have to see more videos of me. Oh, uh, yeah. Do you know what? Bet you don't click that probably. <laughs> Guys, I hope you have a lovely rest of your week or your weekend or whatever you're doing, whenever you're watching this video. It could be 3 a.m. If it's 3 a.m., why are you watching me for? Get to bed. Jesus Christ, it is late. Um, enjoy whatever you're doing. Remember, be humble, be safe, enjoy your job, enjoy your work. Um, and take care of yourselves. I've been Kieran the Barber. Subscribe. Thank you very much.